Welcome to the second season of Rough Cup Cocktails and More. This time you show us the ingredients and we're going to make the cocktails. And you're also going to decide which cocktail gets served at Hide and Seek Guest Bar. Welcome to another episode of Rough Cut Cocktails and More. Today we have yet another interesting and somewhat weird batch of ingredients. And I'm going to introduce you a two main men. We're going to make some cocktails out of it. Off you go. <laughs> Bird's nest. Yakult. Bird's nest and Yakult. Maybe tried it, but not in the cocktail. May the best drink win. Alright, let's right. see. Let's start with bird's nest. <laughs> really? I actually gotta try this because I've never tried this before. I have no idea what I'm gonna do with this Yokot. I'm just gonna have to look through the bowl. Did yeah, I say sugar. really? Interesting. Vanilla sugar. Let's dump this all in there. <laughs> this is some good stuff. Roll project vanilla beans and white sugar. I'm gonna rim the glass now. I think that will go well with uh, my passion fruit in your coat. This is pink grapefruit. All the way from South Africa. I think a good whole passion fruit should do it. I need a good chunk of this rhubarb stuff. Some vermouth in there as well. Trying to hide this lovely bird's nest in some summer. Decent serve of kettle warm vodka. Yeah, a healthy one here as well. Where'd it go? Yeah. I'm going to take this nest up. That is cool. A small squeeze of lemon. That's got a pretty cool color, actually. And you almost done. Almost Getting done. done. Right. Feeling it. Feeling it. It's gonna be good. It's a fine strain. We do want to miss out on some of those pieces. So, uh, get me through. What is it we got here? I have uh, shook up some yokult with uh, fresh passion fruit, a little bit of citrus, balanced it out with some sugar, and uh, a generous serve of kettle warm vodka, of course. On the rim of the cocktail, I've added the homemade vanilla sugar, so I think that flavors should go pretty well together. That works, that really works. That's looking fancy there. Pretty curious myself, is not it? A little. Citrus zest. Okay. And not to forget some grapefruit bitters. There we go. Bird's nest cocktail. <laughs> I would never expect a bird's nest cocktail. What have you got in here? Got some bird's nest soup, whatever you call it. Some rhubarb compote, some vermouth, pink grapefruit, and a good serve of kettle one. Well, I can be honest with you, I've never tried bird's nest by itself, but that cocktail actually tastes really good. Got a tough challenge, difficult ingredients. Once again, it's not my choice. You guys place your votes and decide on what cocktail you want to try to hide and seek for the next two weeks. Think about your health, have some bird's nest. 